save everyone. longer before I take it all down. I'll put the finishing touches on the shrine, take a few pics for the scrapbook. Ugh, that is fucked up. Man, shut the hell up. You've obviously never been a waiter. This is like the only time in my life I'm gonna get to treat an asshole customer the way they deserve. You 
kind of have a dark side, huh? Let me have this. Start with the security huts. See if I can't find Jamal with his speed. Residents gather at the muscle point, please. Jamal was here, all right. I'll check the other hut, too.
fine. I could do this all day. He tried to get out in a red pickup, but with engine noise driving zombies nuts. Daddy made it far. Yep. Didn't make it far. Better have its pocket. narrative. <laughs> Double O oh dear. Best to leave Ethan with a cozy sense of hope, eh? No need to retell this tale.
No, don't tell me. Let me guess your name. So, I think a guy like you would be called... Rav, right? Yes! So Hannah got at least part of my message. I'm glad you're here. I was only halfway done. Well, you're all the way done now. Let's get you back to VCLA. I don't need an escort. I need data. A paramedic friend told me her ambulance got requisitioned to transport barrels here. The soldier said it was stuff to fuck up the zombies. Oh, yeah? What stuff? That's what I need to find out. There were scientists here. I found their workspace, but zombies found me and treated me up like a cat. I need to look at their notes. See if this weapon is something us bobcats can use. Well, if these weapons can fuck up zombies, I want one too. Let me take care of the ambulance. But you'll need a zombie distraction if you want to work. Uh, how about... those speakers? Music! Loud music! Yes! Okay, uh, I'm good with tech. I'll make this work. Let me know when you're on your way back. Cute zombie lurking by the ambulance. It might take a minute. Got it. I'm in a vent now on my way to the workroom. I powered up the DJ setup by the stage in the ballroom. It's ready when you are. I'll aim for a new PB. Caustic puke. It's like they're adapting their weapons to us as well. I get my second best pair. It's one of them on the dissecting table.
got a problem here. Stop playing to the gallery. <laughs> It's a solvent called Caustic X. There's a bill for it with what the actual fuck written on it. The military had barrels of the stuff and were dissolving bodies in the pool. That's surprisingly smart, actually. I was experimenting with acid, but it dissolved my weapons. They went alkaline instead. And I bet they used it in the live ones. We're go on the DJ setup here. Come drop the beat so I can get at their notes. Only beat these zombies are gonna feel is a beatdown. While they're heading to you, I'll get what I can. It's about to.
lifesaver. Literally. I found their notes on Caustic X usage. Anything good? Caustic X works. More or less. But it shouldn't work as fast as they think it does. Up for some field work? Does it involve kicking zombie butt? Loving the attitude. Baller as hell, no cap. And yes, it does. I need you to use that solvent to kill zombies. You said they filled up the pool, and I'll observe from the top floor. Well, don't strain yourself lifting your laptop. It's not science unless you write it down. Well-known fact. <laughs> Whatever. Just be ready for my signal. Ready. Grav, you ready? I am good to go. Begin performing the science. <laughs> By science, you just mean kick him in the pool, right? If you wouldn't mind. <laughs> On wheels, you know that? Fucking pleasure to watch. I checked back in with Hannah and everything's cool now. Thanks for your help. That's what the Zompocalypse helpline is for. Please give me five stars. Now I know it works, it should be simple to causticify a weapon for maximum melting instead of using acid. Until I do, though, here. To the victor go the toy. Ooh, I just got a naughty tingle in me dancing socks. I'll head back to the canals and apply what we found here. We're all in an arms race now, and we have to win it.
Me from the radio. Wait, aren't you? Yes, I am Sarah Shepard. Yes, I am wearing my space box outfit, and yes, this is a bad time. Wow, Captain Dixon. <laughs>
you get. I'll admit it, that was stupid, but also incredibly...